Okay, we just swapped out the battery in this uh, 2014 Ford Flex. Uh, change to a brand new fresh battery. We're going to show you on the X-Tool D7. Uh, we come into special function. And we're going to come into BMS reset. BMS. We are looking for... There we go, Ford. Sorry, went by it the first time. And the Ford Flex. That's the ignition on. Our key is on. Successful operation. So the BMS is reset right there that quick. Um, now, unnecessary step, but just to confirm that, we are going to go into diagnosis, then auto scan, Ford finds our vehicle, we say okay. We're going to go into system selection, body control module, uh, live data. And, uh, okay, here we go. Days in service of vehicle battery, zero days. So that, that confirms the, the reset worked. That's an unnecessary step. You, you can trust that BMS reset on the D7 every time. I was just showing you guys that uh, as, a, as a quick proof that the, that the D7 does its job right there with that, that fast reset. So um, the importance of the BMS reset, these cars are smart enough these days that they will change some things about the charging characteristics based on the age of the battery. Uh, when you're swapping out an old weak battery, you do want to let the vehicle know right away that you put a new battery in. Um, yes, the car would eventually learn that on its own. Uh, I like to go ahead and just do a BMS reset right away. Uh, a lot of retailers putting in a battery will charge you 10 or 15 bucks for that. Um, if you have a D7 or similarly equipped tool, BMS resets that quick.